want to do a quick little battery stamina test here for the gaming on some of the top end Android phones. So like uh, the previous video, we do have the OnePlus 6T Huawei Mate 20 Pro XZ3 from Sony and the Note 9. So some of the best you can get on Android in terms of battery. Uh, and we can just uh, compare here how they all uh, fare for an hour of gaming. So. Uh, we can start up the game here, Asphalt 9, and uh, we, let's just take uh, note of the time. So it's about 7.38 uh, in the afternoon, and we can just start them all going here. So I think we can uh, disconnect them from the power, all at the same time roughly. Uh, and we are ready to hit go on all of them. And so yeah, we're going to come back to them uh, in an hour. Well, Mate 20 Pro being very particular there. Uh, and then see how it does go. I'm betting the OnePlus uh, 6T. Usually they seem to have the best combination of battery uh, optimization and capacity. Uh, but it's going to be quite interesting nevertheless. Note is coming with 4000 mAh battery this year as well. Uh, so that should be pretty good compared to the Note 8. And XC3, you know, it's not the biggest battery, I'm going to be honest. Nice phone, uh, but I don't think it's going to win this particular test, but we'll have to see. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, come back in an hour and see how they go. Hey guys, so it's time to check out the performance here. We are one hour later. Uh, so we're just going to close the game down on all of them and see how the battery is. So what do we have? So if we have a look, you can see Mate 20 Pro uh, is coming in at 92%, very strong. Uh, XZ3, oh, 80%, not so strong there. Uh, we do have the Note 9, which is at 82%, uh, which is quite disappointing actually. Uh, and we have the OnePlus 60 85%, so just below uh, the Mate 20 Pro, uh, which means that the Mate 20 Pro is the winner this year. Uh, usually that isn't the case, usually it is... Uh, you know uh, the Kirin not being very optimized, but it seems that the 980 inside of the device is very efficient this year uh, Maybe we can also have a look at the temperatures Although I don't think this app works with every single phone uh, So yeah, I think you can see it doesn't work with the Note 9 But it does work with these other ones uh, Do we have it on this one? Yes, we do so you can see XC3 running the hottest here and the um, Kirin 980 Huawei Mate 20 Pro very cool uh, compared to the other devices uh, so you can see as well the battery temperatures uh, so very nice performance here from Huawei yet again you know I think you can see uh, top of the pile this year when it comes to Android for the speed as well as the battery life uh, I will be doing some other tests with it, checking out the gaming etc, so do stay tuned for that. I hope you find this one helpful if you're looking at this device, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers!